All right, two pieces of NBA 2K17 uh, news. For one, uh, Adam Silver, commissioner of the NBA, also possible alien, um, uh, dis uh, came out with a, a, some really interesting quotes regarding the E-League that's going to start and is going to be run by NBA teams and organizations, right? Wow. So that's a big crossover. Uh, the first comes from Forbes, in which to give some context to this. So it'll be a professional gaming league backed by the NBA. This will be the first time in history a competitive gaming league will be operated by an American professional sports league. Mm -hmm. The venture is scheduled to start in 2018. The teams will be run by real NBA organizations, and those teams are expected to be announced in the next few months. Each team will have five professional esports players, which is wild. So then... Adam Silver asked, oh, why are you doing this? The popularity of the NBA 2K with the young and growing esports community provides a unique opportunity to develop something truly special for our fans and the gaming community. We look forward to combining our best in-class NBA team operators with Take-Two's competitive gaming expertise and create a brand new league experience. I, this is, to me, is just genius. I know that a lot of Madden and the NFL have tried this. They couldn't agree on something. I know that uh, UFC and UFC the game tried to figure that and they couldn't agree on something. Uh, it, I can tell you, if you play NBA 2K, you're probably a big NBA fan. No doubt. So why not make them feel more inclusive? A lot of people are going to say, oh, they're just gamers. Well, you're about to see how much money pours into a gaming competition. Well, I can think that's so bad. Like, half of the reason people I know in America who are American citizens know a little bit more now than what they did about soccer was from FIFA. Like, you I'm, learn. I'm that exact They person. love well. watching, playing FIFA, and you're just, you're drawing to the same things you watch in everyday life. You want to find out more, you want to explore more, and gaming gives you that opportunity. You go and play the game. NBA, we both know we're not very good. We suck. Whoa. I will be, Jason's I am like, the Brooklyn Nets are a bad basketball team, and they is, might as well sign us up. <laughs> we can yeah, go eight We need to represent how the, let's, let's recruit gamers based, based on, on the teams the and games. the players that are coming in. We could play for the Knicks. <laughs> Get me in there as Chris Tops. Porzingis. No, get Max. Jason in there as you would be the Harlem Globetrotters if they had a team in the NBA because you love to just alley you, but I don't know. Just get great. you in there to be the Globetrotters team. But um, you want yeah. to be the Kristaps Max Zingis. Kristaps Max Zingis. Kristaps Paul Francis. Kristaps. No, I don't know. Kristaps thanks Francis. <laughs> four. Kristaps four Francis. Poor is four, right? Was very good. Poor favor, please and thank you. Right. That's it. My name. Um, but yeah, I'm with this. Good call. Uh, more ways to make money, more ways. I want, to, I want to see the shirts they get to wear. Imagine if they just had the gamers You're wearing the jersey. NBA, wearing the, like wearing like DeMarcus' cousin. Some like, little gamer oh who's like 12 God. years of age wearing a DeMarcus' cousin jersey. Did you see what's there. happening out here? Down these this shit is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, Francis, but what could be possibly better than having NBA 2K teams run by NBA organizations? Well, the most highly touted NBA 2K draft prospect in the history of, of the NBA draft. Barack Hussein Obama. Barack Obama. Roll, Roll tape. tape. <laughs> Ain't no filibuster there. He's taking it to those fools. That First was unbelievable. of all, actually, last of all, I've seen Obama play basketball like on YouTube. He's got a nice shot. Before, like he was, you know, in presidency, like just a good shot. Like he had a nasty Euro step, like when he was like thirty-five. That's the coolest thing ever. It's like when I, Bernie Sanders came to the studio and was like, Junk, why would we even talk about politics? We can just play basketball." D Bernie <laughs> made a shot, right? D I love. You know, it's a good point when Jacory just pops up from the back and goes. Yeah, Bert, he did. He was yeah, like, he why are we that. talking about politics? It's a basketball. Do this ba <laughs> and I, I can't believe Jake wasn't like, no, he's right. Let's, let's play basketball. You just, I feel like if you just made a shot and you called it as a three against Bernie, but you were just a little bit inside, you just go, let me say one thing. Let me say Point one thing. No, no, no. no fingers. Oh, um, so dope. But uh, this, is, this, we're, this is what we expected post-presidency Obama no, to I, be like. I wanna, he's living a dream, man. I'll pay somebody. I will. If we can get a, a, a commenter or somebody, we'll figure out a way. If you can create for us or know how to five on five presidents 2K matchup where you can get like it all <laughs> down, right? You can choose any five presidents or any five presidents. Please send it in. We'll find a way to get you. Who was a really tall, tall president? A lot of uh, Donald Trump's like six six. No, I'm <laughs> Donald Trump's a linebacker. How tall is Trump? 
How tall is Trump? I think he's like 6'1 or 6'2. No, dude, I think he's like 6'5. He's 6'3. <laughs> Donald Trump, 6'6, 350 How pounds. How tall was George, uh, George Washington machine? George Washington. I feel like Abe GW Lincoln was. GW was 6'3. Honest Abe was. 6'4? Yeah, I feel like he was a big guy. Tallest president. Kennedy was small. Abraham Lincoln's listed as the tallest president. Well, yeah. I know who's playing center for my team. Back to the basket. Here we go. Honest Abe. Top hat on. 6'8. Yeah, Let's just with go. or without the, the top hat. Who else have we got in there? Who's next to him? I feel like Andrew Jackson would be a bully down low. Yeah. You know, 6'1. Uh, Lyndon B. Johnson, 6'4. I feel like Clinton would just have a nasty outside shot, you know? But just I like who, smooth. And he'd so smooth like, talk you in between. I mean, here's the problem. James Madison, 5'4. Could he run like the AI offense? I don't know. Maybe. Interesting.